Hey guys, it's Kyle again, and welcome back to Modern Warfare 3 Season 2. So, the first week of the weekly challenges is out, and the first one is the Jack Tyrant 762 kit for the long ball. We've finally gotten a conversion kit for a sniper in this game. All the challenges are easy 30 kills with a suppressor on a marksman rifle, quick scope kills with snipers. I love that that's actually a challenge on here. Triple kills with AR, 7 double kills with battle rifles, and 21 shot kills with shotguns when challenges say recommended like recommended marksman rifles it basically means a modern warfare 3 gun when you go to select a gun in the menu it'll have a fire symbol next to it yeah the challenges are easy we got the kit we're gonna get into some gameplay this kit basically turns the longbow into the Ironsight SAB on Modern Warfare 2. Like, I don't know if you guys remember last year, but that gun, it was menacing to use. The conversion kit on the longbow, it's not as fast, but it pretty much makes it just as consistent in terms of its one-shot kill potential. But yeah, guys, we're going to get into some gameplay, and as always, if you buy a new round here, be sure to like and subscribe for more. Alright, so for the class, I, I can't remember how it works on other conversion kits, but it's not telling me here if these bolts increase the fire rate or accuracy so i'm gonna go ahead and guess that we're not supposed to use the bolt on there obviously you got fastest ads speed rear grip you got a no stock for the fastest ads speed fastest laser now for the fifth and final attachment you could put on an optic i literally don't see the point in that because the whole point in using this thing is to get higher damage but also use its iron sight this kit comes with a default iron sight you could use a magazine apparently these give you tax stand but they don't increase ads speed they might do in game but in the menus it just doesn't say it i was using a muzzle for the start of this game just for the sake of using a suppressor but you can use a barrel that increases ads speed obviously damage range is dropping off but this kit makes the gun more consistent one shot kill wise so you kind of can afford to use a barrel so whichever barrel you want to use just use it but yeah that's the class guys these are the perks i always use if you wanted to you could use mag holster for reload speed but apart from that that's pretty much it guys and enjoy the video all right so here we are we've got this long bow the tyrant kit as you can see, the exact same iron sight as the SAB and the SPR. That's pretty much what it does. It turns this thing into the iron sight SAB. Fire rate is a bit slower, but it's slow compared to the SAB. But it's not a slow fire rate at all. Oh my god. I don't know if you can get like triples or quads easy with this thing or just collapse in general more consistently. I mean, I don't have much experience in it because I haven't hit a triple on this game yet. I haven't even hit a quad collapse ever. I mean, if there was any year to do it, now would be the time. If you don't have this kit unlocked, you can just use the uh, Jack Bullseye Iron Sight, but I, I actually prefer this. The way it looks. I don't know if they've changed the way the bullseye looks, but I don't like it. I don't know why I didn't see him there. What? Are you? Jesus! Jesus! I got a quad feed medal. Did I hit a clip? But yeah, for those of you guys that don't know, this thing, it increases the damage of this thing. It makes it a more consistent one-shot kill, which is why I keep saying it's pretty much the SAB 50 now. Because the SAB on Modern Warfare 2 was way more consistent than it was on this game. Or than it is on this game. I'm using a suppressor anyway, but if you want an even faster ADS speed, just use, just use one of the barrels. Let's give this one a go. That's definitely a more noticeably faster ADS speed. It's all about whether or not the damage is actually good. See, I just got a hit marker already. Sometimes you don't need to go for max ADS speed just to get a good ADS speed. Everyone wants max ADS speed on a sniper, but sometimes it's just not necessary. Yeah, I might actually consider making a versus video comparing this to the SAB. Because the SAB did get buffed. Take 
Oh, there it is. Oh, quad people is a nice little quad kill. But yeah, man, that's how much better you can make the longbow when you've got this thing on. Okay, guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like I always say, if you are new around here, be sure to like and subscribe for more. And I will see you on the next video.